Hey everybody, I'm in front of the storied booth and I am going to go ambush somebody and see if I can't get some information about what's going on because when I was walking through on the live shot, it wasn't quite so good. So anyway, we're gonna get into it because they've got a new product that I am wanting you to see. Totally unsolicited. I'm just gonna go grab somebody and uh, find out what the deal is. So let's go check it out. Welcome to Genealogy TV. This is your first appearance. It is. Tell us, Story literally made its debut, I think, last year at Roots Tech. Yeah. So here we are at Roots Tech a year later. I saw a presentation this morning and I was very impressed. Oh, thank you. So uh, good job. So that's one of the reasons why I want to sit down with you guys today and give everybody at home an idea because Honestly, last year it was such a whirlwind that I didn't quite get it. Yeah. So now there are several components, and I see you've even got this nice little cheat sheet here for me that's got information on it. Um, but tell everybody what is storied. Yeah. So storied, it's funny you mentioned last year because last year we've been out for six weeks, right? And so it was a whirlwind for us too. We have a little more time under our belt. So we're an end-to-end -end family history platform. And what that means is you can come and build your tree. You can do research. We have 300 million newspaper pages that you've digitized. We have 700 million historical records. But then we take that further. Instead of just doing the research, it's a storytelling platform where you can go and capture stories and memories about yourself or about your ancestors. So you can upload photos, audio files, PDF. And then you can take that content and you can collaborate with the group. So I can write a story about a memory I have or about my grandfather, and I can take that content and push it out. And then once we've kind of got that, you have this final piece that we've added this year that's really exciting called Story Books. So I've captured all these stories, I've done this research, and I want to share it in a more tactile or physical way. I can go in and with three clicks, I can, reorder, I can order my stories how I want them. I can choose the ones I want in the book and I print it. And the book will come and like, a week or two, and you end up with something like that. I have to say, I was impressed. I saw this book this morning, and you guys, the quality of this book, and it, you know, this is not sponsored. They're not sponsoring <laughs> me, I promise you. Uh, totally unsolicited. I just was so impressed this morning when I was going through your stuff. I was like, okay, now we need to have this conversation because because uh, we're talking hardbound books, um, and I think what is fun about now I want to get into the website more and we'll throw some some B-roll on here as well to give people an idea of what it looks like. But you can build your tree. Yeah. There's some almost almost some mind mapping kind of graphics that you guys are are doing that I don't think anybody else is doing. Is that right? Yeah, we're we're built on a different technology. And so one of the things that has kind of locked family history in has been the, this family relationship, which is awesome because everyone fits that model, but there are a lot of people in our lives that matter that aren't captured with that model. And so one of the things that we're doing is we're built on something called graph technology. And what that enables you to do is add non-family members or organizations or pets, and we create a structure between those, those relationships. And so we, the, there's an easy way to make discoveries with that. So we have a team member that has a friend that's associated with his account because he put the relationship. This is one of my friends and he got a newspaper match when his friend was in the, was in the newspaper. And so he was able to clip that and send that to his friend and say, Oh my gosh, I just made this discovery. On so we can put friends in there so that we can connect our uh, fan club, yes. right? For those who don't know what the fan club is, it's friends, associates and neighbors, which is a strategy that can really help your uh, genealogy. I tell you what, I have broken down so many brick walls uh, using the fan club yeah. it is unreal. All right, it looks like you got some AI technology either coming or, or is it out No, now? it's out, yeah. So one of the things that we've noticed is storytelling can be hard for some people, right? If you don't have a photo especially. And so we have something called Story Assist. And what that does is if you capture, maybe you remember a few details about your experience. You can put that in and AI will actually generate a rough draft story for you to react to. And you can say, oh my gosh, this is, you know, written in a way that I could actually go make some tweaks and changes and make it my own, but you don't have to do everything from scratch. 
Or we have people that are awesome storytellers, but they don't feel confident in their writing ability, right? Once again, using that story assist technology, we're able to help you kind of get those ideas onto paper and create something for you to react to instead of having to start from the very beginning. All right, you guys got an incredible deal going on this week. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So tell everybody what the uh, what the deal is. Yeah. So look, we're new. We're trying to get the word out about story. And so we, we have a year under our belts. This year, what we've done is we've been, we're including a story book with every annual subscription uh, on the site. We're giving the ultimate subscription on Storied right now uh, away with a free book. And it's all 99 bucks. So, uh, you know, if you're taking advantage of the Roots Tech deal, you can just go to the website too. There's a banner there, you just click it. But for $99, you get access to Newspaper Archive, you get access to Story, and you get a, a free 200-page color hardbound book. All as a part of that deal. That's a hell of a deal. Um, all right, so just so everybody knows, you guys had acquired newspapers, ar- newspaper archive. archives.com, right? Yep. And so that's now part of your repository. So what records do you guys have available for research? Yeah, so we're getting records up as quick as we can. We have been focused on a lot of the base content. So, you know, we just rolled out the 1950 census. We have 1940, 1930s coming soon. Uh, we have SSDI. We have vital records and some military records. Let me stop you. Yep. For those who don't know, SSDI is right. the Social Security Death Index. Yeah. Continue, Thank please. you. <laughs> and so, you know, we have about 700 million historical records up on the site, and we're adding more as quickly as we can. One of the things that's unique about the 1950 census is, you know, when those Im- when those census images come out, companies go and make an index so that people can find those records. Well, there's only two indexes that we're aware of. One index was created by Family Search, Ancestry, My Heritage. They work together. But we, we took the opportunity to create a second or a separate index from them. And the reason why that matters is it means there may be people that got mistyped or, you know, the computer didn't recognize the cursor. And so with a separate index, there's a chance you may not have found your person in the 1950 census on those sites. But if you come to story, you may make that discovery. And so uh, it's not a small effort, but we're really excited about what we've been able to do because it makes people more discoverable. All right. So if people want to take advantage of this deal that's going on, yeah, where do they go? So there's a couple ways. Just go to story.com and um, there's a QR code there or a banner. Okay. You can go to to get.story.com slash roots tech 24 story. Yeah. <laughs> IED. Story. Yeah. So that is. Yeah. Yep. But, uh, or the virtual booth at roots tech, right? Uh, okay. Virtual booth has a link as well. So, and how long is that deal good for? The deal will go through Sunday through this video. Ew, better get it quick. All right. I'll try and get this video out as quick as I can. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Thanks so much.